guys and welcome to a new vlog i think i'm ready to make this my first official english vlog or vlog in english i've been here a week now and i know i need to practice my english and this is the perfect way to do it and if i don't do it i won't practice so i'm gonna, okay so we're doing it this is gonna be my first vlog and if, if it doesn't work out then i'm I'm gonna go back to Swedish, but let's try it out. I need a challenge. I've got packages that we're gonna open. It's still early. Ooh, it's still eight in the morning. So I try to wake up at seven every morning because that's when the sun comes up and it's so beautiful in the morning and I don't want to miss it. Then I just stay in bed for like another hour. And that's what I've been doing. I've been drinking coffee in my bed, scrolling through TikTok, which is a bad habit. I know you're not supposed to look at your phone until like, I don't know, another hour, but that's just what I do. And yeah, it's going to be very interesting to do this whole thing in English. And please don't judge me. <laughs> I will be trying my best. But also I've been thinking because it just makes sense to be speaking English. Not because I'm very good at it or like it's supernatural. To me but i do speak english to everyone that i meet like everyone here i do speak english first okay i'm gonna have to try to wake up and then try to speak not my mother tongue language i do get better though it's a, like the first two days when i got here it's like i've never spoken the english the language of english the american language but now i'm starting to get the hang of it you're like no you're not well, I am. It's a, it's a process and we're trusting it. And this is going to be my first vlog and hopefully you'll notice me progressing, maybe throwing in some fancy schmancy new words that I've learned. We don't know, but that's the goal. And you're just going to have to, please, <laughs> stay with me through this journey. I'm going to be here for my esta, so it's not too long. And if my vlog starts to be super boring, just because I switched to English and my personality is a whack, then just let me know and I'll cry a bit, but also maybe switch back to Swedish. Wow. So I have a favorite clothing store or secondhand clothing store in Sweden, and it's called Broadway and & Sons. And they sent me a package and I love them. And this is so cool. Oh wait, this is perfect. I'm, ugh, I'm trying to elevate my style too because I'm in New York and that feels only right to respect the city with really cool fits. Oh wait! Oh I really like this. It's a vintage hoodie, navy hoodie. Oh I love it. Okay, so what else is happening? I have a private, I have a private Pilates session apparently it comes with my gym membership i kind of get it for free but really i don't because i pay a lot of money for the membership but it's a private session and it's at 10 o'clock so before that i was thinking let's just go get a coffee take a morning walk and then go straight to the pilates well that's my plan anyway i like how long the arms are you know i like my long arms or if you know you know it's still like cropped in a way it's like not too oversized in the length and then we have this Gorgeous color. I feel like if there would be one color that I personally think I look best in it, it's this one. Maybe not with this morning face, but in general, I feel pretty in this color. And I got these jeans. Oh, I hope they fit. Oh my God, they fit perfectly. That never happens. Wow, 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 wow. That makes me so happy. In two days, I'm not gonna be by myself anymore because in two days, or actually, no. Well, tomorrow, technically, Amanda's coming. And for all of you that might be new here, hi, my name is Alice. I'm 26 years old. That's a lot. I am from Sweden. So that's the accent. And then I have a clothing brand called A Design. I love dogs, specifically puppies. And then I have Amanda who's coming. She's working with me, um, helping me edit these videos and film and take photos and just be a good energy to have around. Here's another look. This is cute. Okay, so that was that package. And then I have, oh, my toes, my toes, my toes, my toes. That reminds me, I need to get a pedicure, like real bad. Just after a week here, I have to say this is like the best city in the world.
We're back home. I'm so hungry. So I'm making sweet potato salad. Yeah. Okay, I just finished my meeting, my lunch, getting ready. We're gonna have a quick little Swedish commercial break and then we'll get right back into the video. Hej! Nu är jag hemma i Stockholm som ni ser. Så det här är förinspelat för att jag har fått hem en HelloFresh låda. Och det blir dags för mig att laga ännu ett otroligt HelloFresh recept. Alltså jag är så besatt av HelloFresh och jag tycker att det är den mest smidiga tjänsten för er som uppskattar bra mat. Med enkla recept, med riktigt bra råvaror. Och till er som inte vet så är HelloFresh en tjänst som du prenumererar på. Så du går in på HelloFresh, du väljer ut recept som du tycker ser goda ut. Du får hem allting du behöver, av alla ingredienser, får hem det i en låda till din dörr. Och sen är alla de ingredienserna markerade utifrån ett recept så att du ser exakt vad som ska till vad. Och idag ska vi laga en pannstekt medelhatskyckling med tabule och mild gräslagsdressing. Alltså... Mm, vad gott. Och jag har såklart en rabattkod till er. Koden är HEJALICES. Jag skriver ut den så ni ser. Koden ger er alltså 30% rabatt på första och andra lådan och 20% rabatt på tredje och fjärde. Och HelloFresh gör det så enkelt att laga riktigt bra mat. Och det jag älskar är att det står verkligen hur lång tid det tar att laga varje rätt. Så den här tar 25-35 minuter. Vilket gör att man kan enkelt planera in att laga en riktigt ordentligt måltid utan att det liksom tar hela kvällen av att man behöver gå och handla man behöver planera vad man vill äta man behöver liksom preppa allting allting är redan fixat så nu ska vi laga pannstek med lastkycken And voila! Här har vi den. Alltså det här ser så fruktansvärt gott ut och jag är så hungrig. Nu ska jag njuta av min mat och om ni är sugna på att prenumerera på HelloFresh så använd min rabattkod HEYALICES. Ni kommer inte ångra er, jag lovar. Alltså det här är det bästa, bästa som hänt mig. Mm. Oh my god. And we're back in America. Hi, welcome back. Okay, so I've been debating on coloring my hair for months. Months and months. I've been thinking about like coloring it darker. But the more I'm like looking at my like natural color, it's like gray. It's clearly like dark blonde. And I'm nervous about coloring it and like having it grow out and look gray. Because it's, that's probably what it's gonna do, but also, I live once, and I've never had dark hair. I've always been blonde. And what we're looking at is my natural colors. This is the color I have from being in the sun. And now I'm not gonna be exposed to the sun for a couple of months. So now would be the time to actually try out a darker color. Okay, so. I booked an appointment with the hairdresser that's just down the street that I got recommended and I'm gonna talk to her and see what she thinks. She might just tell me no, we're not gonna do it and then we won't do it. But if she said, you know what Alice, that's a great idea, I think you should do it, then I'm still gonna be nervous but then I might do it. I just don't know. I just don't know. It's weird because I'm clearly blonde, like I know I'm blonde, but I don't identify as a blonde. Is that weird? Like in my head, I feel like I should naturally have darker hair, which I naturally don't. And I also have this theory that everyone looks the best in their natural hair color, which basically goes against everything I'm about to do. So that's great. Pilates was fun. It was not at all as I'm used to. Like I used to do mega former back at home in Sweden, back at home. Mm, this is home now, so back in Stockholm, where I used to live. But now, 
this was different it was fun but it was a private lesson and she was super super sweet the teacher or the instructor but it was like no music and it was very like technical which was good but i'd rather have like a class with several people and some really good music because it's like intense and i need music to like push through it just needs a little shaping to the salon let's go so we're gonna do it but we're doing it Thursday next week. But now I'm having a coffee with a friend. He's not here, but he's getting a coffee. At Ludlow Cafe, which is the best coffee in all of New York, I swear. This coffee is insane. So, since we're not doing the hair today, I figured we might as well get the toes looking cute. So, I'm here for a pedicure. I'm hiding in the bathroom because I I'm too scared to vlog, it's out there, so let's go. So I didn't buy the jacket because it was a bit too oversized, but I really liked it. Now I'm going home because I need to charge my phone. So we're back home. I'm gonna have some snacks. This is fin crisp, very Swedish of me, with cream cheese. And I love crunchy stuff. Like just the crunch itself makes everything taste so much better. Like the flavor is secondary, but the crunch, mmm. You may or may not know that I've been very into like self development everything if it's like spiritual or mental or physical everything self-improvement i've been really into and so i've been reading a lot and i have a couple good books for you guys to read if you're interested to learn more i really recommend you to look into these books because they've taught me so much and also reading is really good like for your brain to not just Honestly, just do something else than scroll TikTok and be stressed about life. I'm reading this book called Atomic Habits. And two things about this book. I bought it in English. I'm laying here on my couch, like reading out loud, like actually practicing how to pronounce words out loud for no one but myself. But it's actually really good because I feel like speaking another language is more so getting used to like how to put the words in your mouth like in my head i know exactly what to say but what comes out is something different so i feel like my tongue or like the way i move my mouth makes all the difference so i need to like practice like my mom or my dad they would always read a little story before bedtime so it's like i'm doing that with myself and it's really cozy anyway the book is about building good habits and breaking bad ones and basically it tells you everything you kind of already know and like it's a small step that gets you to the big goal basically but it's a really good reminder and i really recommend this book i'm only 37 pages in but it's going slow because i'm reading out loud and i have to like reread some stuff because i'm learning new words this is the life as a lonely swede in new york with this view and i'm gonna answer a question that all of you have been asking me on how i got this apartment and here it comes okay so before moving to new york i'm gonna say that i moved to new york i know i'm only allowed to be here for 90 days but who knows i might stay like i will go back to sweden i know i have to but i might come back Anyway, before coming here, I, I didn't have anywhere to stay and I was checking Airbnb every day and all the options were so bad. I was like, it's gonna work out. Like, I'm manifesting the shit out of this. And one day, I checked my DMs and there was this girl who just got a job as a real estater in this firm in New York. And she told me that they do, like, they rent out apartments too and she could help me with exactly what i wished for she reached out to me and gave me amazing options and i chose this one and i'm 
so happy I did. You can see, this is a dream. I'm so blessed to be able to afford this right now. And this has been my dream since I was a teeny tiny, teeny, teeny, weeny, baby, weeny girl. And so I'm just like splurging, but also I'm doing this for her, kind of. And yeah, so the girl works for nest seekers. And if you're interested in finding a place, then you could contact them. But it's no collaboration, none of that. So yeah, they're just, she was really good at her job. So check them out. Yes, hello. Okay, I'll come down and get it. We have practice. Okay, okay, sure. <laughs> oh my god. official Amazon order and so I feel very American because Amazon apparently has everything like socks they have like oh speaking of socks I bought socks and then here is remember this one so this is for my laundry I feel like such a wifey just without a husband anyway <gasps> Ooh, is this what I think it is that would make me very excited. Yes! So many of you guys recommended this. It's like a filter where you fill this bad boy up with water. I'm excited to try. It's gonna be a lot of boxes. I don't know if you guys had this. Like, I might be older than you are. Anyway, when I was in school, there was this specific candle. Like, if you know, you know. Yankee candle, and it has to be clean cotton. Cotton? Co cotton. Ca mm. Cotton. <laughs> Clean cotton. I have to be British to say that. Clean cotton. I don't even know. But Yankee Candle. I saw it and I didn't need it, but I bought it. I feel like that's what Amazon does to you. Like, you, if there's too much. There's too much. Okay, so this is like a suction. <laughs> I could just put this on the wall and then put it on my phone. I'll show you. This is like a... Um, like a light that you put on your phone or camera. And I'm gonna use this whenever it's dark, like a LED light. Also, we're going into the season of my skin getting really dry. And so I bought the skin food. If you try this, you know how like it's so moisturizing and it's so good. I needed a tripod. But then I realized I might as well order a ring light so I have like a tripod and a ring light in one. So I have one in Sweden but I couldn't travel with it. So I ordered one and this is not Amazon. I know that for a fact. Still very excited though. This is a brand called Aritza. Aritzia, sorry. And they have some really cute stuff. And they sent me a bodysuit. It's like the perfect outfit for Pilates. And then they sent me like a puffer vest. And it's really cute. It's like a silver, silver color. I love this. Thank you so much. I'm so excited about this. You have to check them out. They have so much cute stuff. This is a sports top. Very cute. And then a skirt. Very cute. Oh my God. Like over, over, oversized gray sweats. This is really cute. I love this jacket. Wow. Well. I'm obsessed. Okay, one last package, you guys. I'm almost done. Bear with me, guys. Oh. 
well thank you for watching this far but this is um toilet paper so yeah that was that now i need to clean this mess up that was my little amazon haul Let's go to the gym. bunch of groceries because today Amanda's coming and I want her to have the best welcome and to me that means a full fridge so I bought some of my favorites and I also want to do some meal prepping because I need I don't eat enough protein like I really need to get more protein into my diet so yeah I'm gonna cook some meal preps so I always have it ready. Okay, so now I just freestyled a marinade with olive oil, garlic, soy sauce, honey, salt, pepper, lemon, and that's it. And it smells good, actually. And here is the final result. The chicken is amazing. I'm so proud. And yeah, this is today's lunch. I made some extra. I just started watching a series called Lie to Me. And I started last night. And if you know, you know. So I'm gonna keep watching that. It's really good. Okay, Amanda arrives in like three hours. And I just realized that I've been here for like 10 days, but I haven't been to Central Park yet. So I'm gonna go buy myself a coffee, of course, and then we're gonna take a long walk to Central Park, see what's up, and then meet Amanda when she gets back or when she arrives. I'm excited. The sun is shining and it's an amazing day. So we're going to Central Park. This is my little outfit for today. Tights, Bianbori, hoodie A design, my new socks from Amazon, balance is nowhere to be found, and my hookah sneakers. Okay, so I took water way above my head and I got halfway. I'm at Joan and Joe's, I ordered coffee and then I'm gonna go home. <laughs> so, Central Park another day. This is your room? <laughs> oh my god! What the fuck? What the fuck, man? <laughs> this is a view. I've been expecting you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> my happy face right now. Oh my god! This is your bathroom. And since, <laughs> since you have a very sensitive stomach, I did... <laughs> you did some shopping? I did some shopping. This is okay. my room. Oh my god, Alice. I have to show you more. Okay, let's go. India's. Oh my god. I'm not a convinced. 
Vad lite jag skriver listor. Så att vi inte redan bara. Ja, men kommer. Oj, vad skönt så på va. Har du inte sett detta själv? Ja, men jag är ju sutt här. Nej, men jag tror inte du förstår. Jag tror verkligen inte du förstår. Vad är det här? Nej, jag tror inte jag förstår faktiskt. Alltså, vad är det här? Det är ännu sjukare än att det är mörkt. Alltså, jag längtar. We are getting dinner. We got the salmon, and I'm gonna make some pasta. Mm -hmm. 